The Rye Pale Ale was born from a Christmas brew. Every Christmas, um, we the brewers will do a beer for our colleagues to share with their friends and family. In Guinness Rye Pale Ale, we've used two varieties of hops um, that complement each other. Both are actually American varieties, um, Mosaic and Cascade. The combination of the Mosaic and the Cascade hops in Guinness Rye Pale Ale give you a citrusy and slightly peachy flavour. In every beer that we use here, there's a lot of similarities. So they'll all have the Guinness yeast, but the key thing with this one that separates it is it has the rye malt. Rye is reasonably commonly used in an IPA, um, less commonly in a pale ale, but a use of rye gives you a nice spicy, peppery finish. Instead of a lot of that bitterness, you substitute quite a lot of sweetness. Now it does still have that lovely grapefruit kind of citric element that you would get from a lot of pale ales, but we've brought that sweetness to it by using some rye malt. And I think the two of them mesh really, really nicely together. When we released the rye pale ale to friends and family and colleagues, everyone loved it. Everyone was asking for more. Why not brew a batch to keg? Why not brew a batch that we can now serve in our Open Gate brewery? And that went down extremely well. One of our quickest selling in the Open Gate bar as well. And that kind of planted the seed. We kind of thought, maybe this is a beer that can go the distance. Maybe this is a beer that we should bring out to market.